Hi, I'm Doris Roberts, and today I want to talk to you about something that is very dear to my heart, the rescue and rehabilitation of abused and neglected farm animals. Branch Hand Rescue is a group dedicated to helping farm animals that have been abandoned, abused, and neglected. Normally, they would not have survived, but would have had to be put down. But thanks to Ranch Hand Rescue, they can have a new life and a new purpose. Ranch Hand Rescue. Ranch Hand Rescue is a group dedicated to helping animals and people alike. Ranch Hand Rescue has three main purposes. Rehabilitation. Ranch Hand Rescue rescues and rehabilitates abused farm animals. Abused farm animals are rescued from their harmful environments and taken to the facility for rehabilitation. There, the needs of the animals are addressed on an individual basis, one-on-one. -on -one. Everything possible is done to save the animals and bring them back to good health, both physically and emotionally. Sanctuary. Ranch Hand Rescue provides the animals with sanctuary. After the animals are rehabilitated, they are given safe, comfortable homes where they will be cared for, protected, and loved for the rest of their lives. They will never be harmed again. Equine and Animal Assisted Therapy. How the rescued animals help people. Ranch Hand Rescue provides a unique opportunity for the animals. There are people who have faced trauma in their lives similar to those of the animals. For example, there are veterans, children, and others who have the need for artificial limbs. Ranch Hand Rescue has veterans and children meet the rescued animals. The veterans and the children see that animals who were once abused can now live happy lives. This gives them new hope. In return, the animals now have a purpose in their life, to help rehabilitate people. Equine and animal assisted therapy is a new and exciting field of rehabilitation. Ranch Hand Rescue is on the cutting edge of this powerful therapy. Ranch Hand Rescue also deals not only with animals, but with children, abused children. And I want to share a story about one little abused boy. Unfortunately, he was sexually abused by his father, and the child is traumatized by that and won't talk to anyone about it, not to the therapist, not to friends, not to anyone. And he just hides this secret, this terrible story, and he keeps it in inside and he won't talk to anyone. Well, a horse came in with a broken leg and the little boy asked one of the therapists what happened to the horse. He said, well, the man who owns him beat him with a bat and broke his leg. At this point, and the horse was lying down, this little boy went up to the horse, got down on his hands and knees, and whispered into the horse's ear what his father had done to him. He was safe, you see, because the horse can't speak and he could share his secret with a new friend, the horse. This is who we have to support. This kind of work, this kind of help, is a This is what we are working with. This is what we need your help for. It's a new way of life for these children and these, and these animals. And let's help, it, help them make it a wonderful life.